Alright y'all, listen, welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. I ain't gonna lie, y'all been loving my videos. I appreciate every single last one of you. And yesterday, we hit, well last night I should say, or this morning, I guess. I'm guessing this, maybe this morning. Or maybe last night. I went to sleep early last night, so I don't even know. But we hit a thousand subscribers, so appreciate you. Appreciate every single one, everybody that's rocking with me. We shooting for 10k next. And then after that, you know, 100k. I'm going for it. But without further ado, we got Machine Gun Kelly Glass House featuring Naomi Wild. We're going to see what they t t t t talking about. Glass House. Alone in the glass house, fly away, away till the sun's out. Think sky when you come down Empty in the driveway Caffeine for the heartache Never wanna have it my way Yeah, I fuck up and lose control Burn so many bridges, got nowhere to go Bitches got these motives like Anna and Nicole I'm smoking cigarettes alone until Hold on. I know he didn't say who I think he said. Hold on. First so many bridges got nowhere to go. Bitches got these motives like Anna and Nicole. I'm who, which, 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 who, which one he talking about? He talking about the, uh, Anna Nicole Smith? The one that was, I think she was, I think she was, uh, I think she was named like what? Uh, she was like what? Named Playmate of the Year? And that, isn't that the same girl that also went on to... Married this, uh, I think she married a, was he a millionaire or a billionaire? I think it was a billionaire. Yeah, and I think she was what? She was what? She was what? She was what? She was, what? She was 39. She was 39, bro. Married at 80, 89, I think. I want to say 90, 89, somewhere in his 80s. He was a millionaire, a um, billionaire, 80, 89, probably, or 90. Bro. Everybody knew that the only reason she married him was because she probably thought that she was going to be able to get, you know, everything that you give to someone when you die. Like, she thought she was going to be in his will, but she wasn't. And she took, and the crazy part is she took his son to court to try to, you know, gain something out of that. But she didn't. So y'all got to be careful, bro. Y'all got to watch out, son. It's stuff like that. And plus, that stuff like that, you don't really see. Like a 39-year-old with an 89-year-old. Like, come on. Like, do you really see that on a daily, a uh, day-to-day -day basis? Do you really see those type of couples out here? A 39-year-old with an 89-year-old. Come on. Come on now. Let's let's keep it real. <sighs> come on. Talk to me. Smoking cigarettes alone until it burn a hole In my lungs, in my soul, in my denim coat Same place I'ma keep that knife if I'ma slip my throat This shit ugly, I was just with Nipsey, now he goes They Damn. got my homie Pete out here like fuck the jokes Damn Alone in the glass house Just keep it going Fly away till the sun's out Think sky when you come down Sometimes I wanna fucking scream or run away, I don't know Hey. Life's been hard since 17. I've been through hell. I think I'm somewhere in between. 17 is when he had his daughter, right? Caught in purgatory, I can paint the scene. Everything turned to a nightmare from a dream. Look, wish little peep and me had spoke, but I can't get that back. Just came from Pittsburgh, damn, I miss my homie Mac. Yeah. Last time I got off the stage, I looked Chester in the face, and now he gone. And damn, bro, why you gotta name them? Damn. Bros lost, he lost Mac, Lil Peep, Chester. But I ain't gonna lie, I feel like Chester, that his, his death, like that shit really hit. That shit hit bigger than probably all three, the all two of them. Out of all three of them, I think Chester's death hit bigger. For the simple fact, bro, his music was, I'm not saying their music wasn't worldwide, but it was just, Linkin Park was just different. Linkin Park was just different. Damn, son. 
We losing too many artists, man. Don't stop. No going back. I've been sick of living and nobody knows how I'm really feeling. I like always suicide. hate to smile, but the key what is killing me hidden inside. I didn't sign up to be the hero, but I don't want to wind up a villain. I put my daughter to bed. And Machine Gun Kelly got to be a Batman fan. I feel like I heard that. I feel like I heard something like that before. Let me see if I remember. Um, Let me see if I remember. What was it? Was it Was it Dark Knight? Who was it? Uh, Was it Harvey Dent? I think he... It was Harvey Dent. He said, you either die a hero or live long enough to see yourself become a villain. Whew. I remember that shit like I just watched it yesterday. Whew. Oh, my God. That's true, though. That's true. I didn't sign up to be the hero, but I don't want to wind up a villain. I put my daughter to bed and attempted to kill myself in the kitchen. Yeah, I should have screamed, but nobody listened. So I passed out with the blood dripping in this glass house, feeling like a prison. Damn. Damn. Said I put my daughter to sleep? Tried to kill himself? Damn. Damn. And that's true, man. Like they say, you put on that fake smile, you really don't know what a person is going through. You think they, they happy, all jolly and everything because they put that fake smile on? Listen, that that's behind that smile is something deep. It's deeper. It's deeper than what you're thinking. It's deeper than what they, you know, what they are uh, portraying. In front of you, right then and there, is deeper than that. Me and Death keep tongue kissing. I just fell out with my little bro. The life getting to us, the drink getting to us, the drugs getting to us. It's highway to hell, and everybody knew what the fuck are we doing. I'm feeling like. Now, I'm not saying, like, their definition of a glass house is, like, literally the, the definition of it. But, you know, there's other meanings to it. But for me, just based on, you know, seeing him stuck in that glass and seeing her stuck in that glass, it's like being stuck in, like, a glass house is, is basically just a place where everybody can see and judge you. You know what I'm saying? And it feels like, you know, it's just a place that you're trapped inside. So it's like, I do not, you know what, I don't want to say that. I don't even want to say that. But it's just like your emotions and everything is all, it's like, say you're in the glass house like they was in the video, right? Everything is stuck in there with you. Your emotions, how you feeling, everything is all in there. But people want to know because they only see you. They don't see, you can't really see, you don't see emotions. You don't. You can see emotions based on how the person is, but like MGK said, he likes to put on this smile like everything is okay. But not knowing the, you would think that they're happy, but you just don't know the emotions that's going around in them. So like while he's stuck inside the glass house, his emotions is all around going crazy. You can't see that. You just see him just standing there and that's it. You feel me? I don't know if I explained it right. I tried my best, but listen, that's just, that's how I see it. But anyways, man, I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. Like, subscribe, comment, turn on your bell notification so you're notified every time I drop a video. And today I'm going to catch you guys in the next one. Peace. We out. We on.